The next tool you should focus on in Excel is how to use Power Pivot. Power Pivot is a data modeling tool. Now, don't confuse this with a regular pivot table. The pivot table is great for summarizing a single data set, but Power Pivot goes a step further. It allows you to create a model by combining multiple data sets, linking them with relationships, and allowing you to analyze them together. Here's how to start. First, you need to activate Power Pivot. So come to Excel, come to File, come to Options, click Add-ins. In Manage, change the selection to Come Add-ins and click Go. In the Come Add-ins box, enable Microsoft Power Pivot for Excel and click OK. This will automatically create an extra button here called Power Pivot. If you have it activated already, very good. Once activated, you can load multiple tables into the data model. This is how to do it. Click on any of the tables. Let's start with the sales table. Then go to Power Pivot, then click Add to Data Model. Good. Click the Products table. Select any of the data points. Click Add to Data Model. With this, we have the sales table and the product table in Power Pivot. Next, you create relationship. You link the sales table with the product table using the product ID. In Home, come to Diagram View. This is the sales table. This is the product table. We have the product ID here. We have the product ID. ID here. The direction does not matter. You can go from sales to product or product to sales. Drag the product ID from the sales table to the product ID in the product table. It must drop directly on top of it to save this. Click on refresh. Refresh all is a success and then we close and we close our power pivot. We have created the data model. Next, we'll create the pivot tables directly from the data model. Come to the transaction table. That is sales. Come to insert. Click on the drop down where we have pivot table and select from data model. Choose where you want the pivot table to be placed let's select new worksheets and then we click ok we have this as our model we have the product table and we have the items from the product table and we also have the sales table we have the items from our sales table this makes excel work like a mini database some of the things you can do in sql you can now carry them out using excel